been going through the Nanyuki trip. I have done day one of the trip, uh, which is basically an introduction and showing you what I would do in the wild. And it was quite amazing, good reception. So now we're going to the part two. Part two is basically the game drive where we go to the wild and, you know, see the animals, see lots of beautiful stuff, beautiful nature. And this is to inspire you to get out there and experience Kenya. So this particular part is just about the game drive and I'm going to have both still pictures and videos uh, all through. And I said that in the third section and the fourth section going forward, we're basically going to have a chat with friends about money and travel. Very interesting section. That's where you get to know how do we get the money to travel? How did these guys manage, these experts manage to travel to such a beautiful place? Uh, at a time when everyone is complaining about money. So if you're waiting for that money talk here We're gonna have that money talk in the third part going forward and it's beautiful because it's not just my opinion But this is my opinion supported by people who actually travel uh, I have a group of friends. You've seen them in some of the videos They will be sitting down and telling you what do you what do they think about traveling and you know experiencing this kind of life and How does the money come through for traveling? Anyway, guys, I uh, just wanted to make sure that uh, you know how this series is running. So we have part one already. This is going to be the second part with the game drive, beautiful sceneries. And then we have the third part, fourth part, fifth part. It's quite a long video. I'll decide later where to stop. But I think there's a lot of information that can actually help people grow and uh, that are very relevant to our financial life. And of course, experiencing life as we want, because like we say in Money Matters, it's not just about the money you invest. It's all about the experience you get or the experience that your money buys for you. So guys, stay tuned uh, for this series. Enjoy this uh, game drive and then stay tuned for more talks with friends on money and travel. Anyway, guys, thank you for the support. Subscribe, like and share.
Nanyuki or Benjeta. This is the Kenya Wildlife Conserv Conservancy, right? Tell me, yeah. Uh, okay. Conservation Park at conservation the park. park. Yeah, and we are at the uh, Rhino Memorial, basically a cemetery. Yeah, and uh, these are the rhinos that have died in this park. You can see the name of the rhinos. For example, here we have Asha, female black rhino, born on 28 Feb 2008, died on 15th April 2016. Cause of death, shot by poachers at at 10 p.m. on 15th of April 2016. And both horns were removed. Horrible poachers. Here we can see Mwingo, male black rhino, born again in Feb 1987, died 2016, shot by poachers. And uh, both horns removed. Really sad. Here we have Carol, female black rhino, born 15th June 1980, <laughs> died 2015. Gunshots reported on the second of deck in the evening and carcass found the next day. Both horns missing. So this whole place is full of rhinos. Uh, where I'm standing is uh, these are rhinos that died that were killed by poachers around this area. Behind the tree, the other side, are rhinos that died natural death. So yes, this is the memorial area for the rhinos, guys. Stay tuned for more. We're still in the game drive. Coming up.